We've got uh, Kyle Quincy, who's the newest Blue Jacket, just acquired today in a trade with the New Jersey Devils for Dalton Prout. Kyle, it's uh, Bob McElligot and Jody Shelley here. First of all, welcome to the Blue Jackets. Uh, did this surprise you hey. today? Hey, guys. Thanks. Thanks for having me. Were you, uh, were you surprised, or did you think something like this might be coming for you? Uh, yeah, they sent me out of the game uh, two days ago. I heard work uh, and stuff, and down the wire there. So I was uh, just about getting on the plane to Washington, so I wasn't really sure. But uh, they, uh, they told me right before we left, and uh, that was up. Kyle, you're, you're uh, going to be one of the older guys here in the locker room. How excited are you to be a, a kind of veteran guy, which you have been for a while, but with this young group that's uh, having a heck of a season, how excited are you to get here and be a part of this? Yeah, it's definitely it's really exciting. Uh, it feels like it's the way the league's going now. I'm 31 as an old guy now. So, <laughs> um, you know, when I was in Detroit early in uh, 35 was uh, normal. We had some older guys on that team, but... I'm um, definitely excited and uh, looking forward to it. And when you talk about that experience in Detroit, you were obviously a younger guy then, and you had some of those veterans in the dressing room. Now, on the flip side, what do you hope that you can bring to this team and, and use that experience that you got while you were there, where, wherever you've been in your career? Uh, how much are you looking forward to using that experience to help this group of young guys along? Yeah, you know, I, I'm very excited. Um, I've kind of been doing that for a couple years uh, it seems like uh, where I'm slated in the decor on most times, I'm, I'm with a younger guy. Um, so you know, it's fun to kind of go over our shifts and kind of help uh, whoever it is uh, just with the little details of the game, which makes uh, such a big difference. And uh, kind of, I, I just feel like those uh, little things go a long way, and uh, especially when you're in a playoff run. Um, one little shift here or there kind of can make or break a series. And is that kind of the message you're getting from this organization, coming as that veteran who's been to the playoffs and really with this young decor can maybe settle things down in those pressure situations? Uh, you know, I haven't had any really concrete talks or anything, but uh, that's kind of my game. Um, uh, I'm not really flash, uh, flashy, I would say, uh, but uh, I can contribute offense, uh, a little bit, but um, definitely uh, I kind of concentrate on the defense uh, part of the game and uh, kind of let the forwards do their job and we'll, we'll keep the puck of our net. And uh, that's the way I think um, and playoff hockey definitely is. Like I'd rather win 2-1, one, one nothing than 7-6 for sure. Yeah, there's no question. You're, you're hard to play against. I, I know that for sure. <laughs> We're talking with Kyle Quincy. He was acquired by the Blue Jackets from the New Jersey Devils today. Kyle, going to New Jersey, we were talking about this earlier. Uh, you guys started off really well this year and really got it going, and now it's backed off a little bit there. Just to be going from a team that's not in the playoff picture to being in a t to going to a team that is in the playoff picture right now and knowing that there's going to be uh, postseason play here, how much more exciting does it make it in a trade like this? No, it's great. And like you said, uh, the league right now, it's, any team can beat anyone on a certain day. So, you know, we feel in Jersey, we've been playing very hockey, but just not getting points. And the, the line is so fine from those teams like Columbus and Washington and Pittsburgh, where they win those games when teams that are out looking in now are saying, what if, what could have been? And it's a very fine line. So I'm very fortunate to be, on a team that uh, has found uh, that success. And I know in uh, recent years, you guys, this is a hot part of the year for you guys. You usually, usually uh, ramp it up right now. So it's exciting to, to be on the squad. Hey, I'm wondering, is there anyone on this team that you're familiar with, players, coaches, that you've uh, been with in the past? Um, I played with Murray at the World Championships for a year when they were uh, before he was drafted. And then I played with Jack Johnson in L.A., um, I think Felino uh, as a in passing, but uh, definitely excited uh, to meet all the boys uh, tomorrow. Now, what th there is a personal side of this too, right? Your life has just been thrown in upheaval. You've got to move from Jersey to Columbus, be here, as you mentioned. There's a game tomorrow for crying out loud. What's your schedule from now until then? 
Uh, I just got home. Uh, very, very lucky. I was, we were still in Jersey, so uh, got home. Uh, I'm gonna pack here and get on a flight around six and uh, get a nice bite to eat in Columbus and uh, get ready for tomorrow. A place where you're probably pretty familiar with, since you played with Detroit for all those years. Say that again, sorry. A place here in Columbus you're probably pretty familiar with. Oh, for sure. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we've been there a few times. Yeah. So if they put yeah. you in a downtown hotel tonight, you'll know exactly where to go. You've done it a million times. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I'm, yeah, I know my way around. <laughs> well, Kyle, thank you for taking a couple of minutes for us. Uh, we really do appreciate it. Welcome to the Blue Jackets. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Thanks for having Kyle. me. Yep. Kyle Quincy, defenseman for the Blue Jackets, picked up today in exchange for Dalton Prout from the New Jersey Devils.